within the alumni is, in, is embodied the entire reputation of a university. And therefore, as students graduate, they're engendered with the seed that will lead to that. And I, uh, I've been a citizen of uh, the New School for 20 years. And I've always tried to do at least three things. Uh, one is to make sure that our students, when they leave here, uh, enter into a very meaningful job, something that's uh, powerful uh, and rewarding to them. And that they wake up every day and they say, I love doing this. And my next job, which is more important, is that 10 years hence or 20 years hence or 30 years hence, they wake up and they say, I love doing this. All right? um, so I'm an information designer. I'm a senior information theorist within PIM and uh, uh, prof associate professor of information design within Parsons. And uh, we teach uh, this stuff. And basically, it's information design is essentially data visualization. But from the creative side, it's less deductive and more inductive. And our students uh, attempt to really get big pictures of things rapidly and then bring that back to the engineering side. Um, this is done by Jennifer Shim, and uh, it's essentially the history of media, uh, media use from 1850 till today, and you see these major disruptions of digitalization and also that last section where you have the, uh, the smartphone, where things are integrated. So um, I've used up my minute, but I'm going to give 20 seconds to Jennifer. Um, she sent a letter to me uh, two months ago. And uh, modesty and time, those twin darts, caused me to take excerpts. But I just want to read a very short piece. She says, I talk with fellow colleagues and alumni on a daily basis and hear from them about their struggles as it relates to obtaining a full-time job. Fortunately for me, I've not yet had to apply for a job interview. Instead, recruiters and senior directors across the country have been finding my work and contacting me to inquire whether or not I would be interested in working for their company, even though I do not fit the standard three years experience criteria. Knowing and understanding how to construct big data visualizations enabled me to efficiently understand not only how to create design for tech prototypes, such as web and mobile, but also for internal communication pitches, prototype spec process sheets, etc. Thanks to your mentorship and guidance, my portfolio was found by the senior director of the visual tech division at Cisco Systems, headquartered in Silicon Valley. The salary was so significantly higher than average salary of an entry-level designer elsewhere. And I thank you. I hit the ground running. <laughs>